The king of customization, Android, is now playing catch up with iOS. And with Android 14, Google brings us lock screen customization, but not at the level of Apple because we still do not have lock screen widgets. However, something is better than nothing. And in this video, I'll show you how you can customize the lock screen on your Android devices which are running Android 14. Now do note this here is the Google Pixel 7 which is running the latest stable build of Android 14. So to access your lock screen customization options you have a few ways. First way is to press and hold on the empty space on your home screen. Go into wallpapers and style. Here and you will see that right now home screen is selected. But if I tap on lock screen now, lock screen is selected and any customizations I make over here will customize the lock screen. Next method is to go into settings, wallpapers and style. Again, we are on the same menu. The third way is from your lock screen itself. So here it is. I'm going to press and hold on my lock screen. I get the option of customize lock screen. I, of course, do have to unlock my device and of course the fingerprint scanner on the pixel 7 well hopefully they do improve it with the pixel 8 but here it is we are on the same menu so lock screen is highlighted which means i am now customizing the lock screen first thing you can change is you can change your clock style so you have a bunch of different options you can use whatever one you like now some of them like this one over here is going to change the color with material use so here on the bottom are your most recently used color schemes for material you on android 14 if i select this one you will notice that the clock color has in fact changed and it is working with material you i think all of them change colors with material you but not at the same level so here it is this one if i choose the monochrome theme bam there it is you can see that it has in fact changed then if you tap on this option clock color and size you can again if you want a specific color so let us say i want this color for my clock i can do that and you can choose from a bunch of different options then you have a slider on the bottom using this you can configure the intensity of the color so there it is you can see the pink is going from light to dark as i move the slider now do note that if you're using the default color theme then this slider is grayed out because it is going to use the material u colors if you tap on size you can either say dynamic in which case google decides what works best for you or you can say small so this is how the small one is going to look like me personally i prefer to use dynamic and then we can go back so here it is we are on the main page now next up let us say you want to change the wallpaper on your lock screen so here on bottom are your five most recently used wallpapers and if i select this one you will see that the preview here is going to change if you want to choose any other wallpaper you will go into more wallpapers and from this menu you can choose any other wallpaper which you want to use so let us say i want to use this one over here so now i am on the preview window of my lock screen there it is you can see on the top left it is telling me preview and if you tap on the eye it will give you some information about this picture if i tap anywhere else i'm back on the preview screen and in case you want an actual full screen preview without the word preview and these options on the bottom tap anywhere on the empty space and bam here it is this is my preview of the lock screen even before i have applied it and on the top right you have the button to close it then if you are happy with this wallpaper you're going to say set wallpaper and now you have options to either apply it to the home screen the lock screen or to both let us say we want to apply it to the lock screen only and there it is it is setting the wallpaper and now this one is the wallpaper on my lock screen and that is my setup as well there it is you can see working like boss and another pro tip over here is that if you ever want to see a preview without trying to change the wallpaper just tap over here and bam here it is you can see this is our preview screen where we were before then if you scroll down on this very page you can also now customize the left and the right shortcut so select shortcuts and then you have the option of left shortcut so here it is left shortcut and right now it is set to mute so you can choose it to be none if you want you can try to open the camera 
device controls switch to do not disturb then you have your flashlight mute qr code scanner video recording and wallet and those are the only options unfortunately google is not letting you customize it to a deeper level wherein you can plug in any application over here pretty sure they'll add it with android 15 then you can also customize the right shortcut and the options remain the same so you have flashlight mute qr code scanner video controls wallet camera device control and none along with do not disturb then you also have a toggle to enable or disable the notifications on the lock screen if you go into more lock screen options you can of course configure your privacy and whether you want to see all the content do you want to show only sensitive content or do not show notifications at all then if you want to add a custom text on the lock screen you have the option for that do you want to enable your device controls if you have any smart devices google speakers connected then you can enable this toggle shortcuts will take you to the same menu i am not sure why google just keeps on repeating the same menus again and again then if you want a double line clock or not so that is something which you can enable or disable now playing if you want to enable always on display do you want to enable tap to check do you want to enable lift to check phone and do you want to wake your lock screen for new notifications or not so there it is peeps those are all the customization options for the lock screen on your android devices running android 14.